Just look at this car beside me. Do you like it? Well, it could be a future Chevrolet, and it's been created by an English designer. What Chevrolet is wanting to do is actually appeal to younger buyers. They went out and they talked to a group of people known as the Millennials, and they're people aged between 11 and 30, and basically they're future car buyers. So Chevrolet asked them, what do you want from a car? And they said, well, we want something sporty that has enough seats to carry four people. And, well, this is what Chevrolet has come up with. Now, this actual car, it's front-wheel drive, it's based on the crew and under the bonnet there you've got a 1.4 litre turbo engine so it could actually run they could put something like this into production what Chevrolet are going to do with it next they're taking it to various motor shows take it to lifestyle events and they're even going to be canvassing people's opinion via Facebook and Twitter to see how to evolve this car and what eventually put in production now I quite like that white concept which incidentally is called the true 140s but Chevy have also produced another concept and the same plans called the Code 130R. And this is it here. It's a really stunning machine, actually, isn't it? Quite muscular in its stance. Now, once again, this has a 1.4 litre turbo engine, but there's a big difference because rather than being built on the cruise like the white car, this one is built on the platform of the new Cadillac ATS. And that means that the power goes to the rear wheels, which should mean this one is even more fun. Now they're probably deciding which model to put into production, this one or the white car, or maybe even both, but if I had a choice, I'll probably go for this one. Now I don't know about you, but do you think that the rear part of this car looks a bit like the BMW 1 Series Coupe? Well, it kind of does, and well, this car will be along the same lines as that really, if you think about it, although being a Chevy, of course, it'd be a lot more affordable. And I've spoken to some people within the company, they said that they were gonna do something like this, they'd want it to start from around 18,000 pounds.